Right. Negotiations. I don't, I don't like leaving a serious topic for this, but this is a topic that I know everybody in the country, except for me, is very concerned about. <laughs> and it's a question from Samina Hussein. Let's just have that before we finish. You've got a couple of minutes. Does Suarez's four-month match ban suggest football is soft and violent behaviour? Is football soft and violent behaviour just for four months for biting a shoulder? You never bit anybody's shoulder, John, did you? <laughs> <laughs> you probably wanted to, but... I don't... <laughs> I'm a bit traditionalist like that. Yeah, just a right hook and... <laughs> <laughs> well, I told Tony I only did it because he asked us to connect with the electorate, so I did. <laughs> Suarez, properly treated? Is it right? Should he have been drummed out of football he's, altogether? He's, he's, he's a shocker. He's I a mean, shocker. It, it's so sad, isn't it? Because he's actually a brilliant footballer. I mean, he's absolutely... Even Paul, we would agree on this, wouldn't we? Liverpool, because Liverpool, Liverpool, Liverpool fans. <laughs> but, I mean, it was outrageous. Third time he's done it. Personally, I'd have him, if you could, criminally, he should be charged. Um, and he, you know, it's, if something like that, he'd be looking, he'd be right mm. on the edge of going away. Four months, I'd <clears> make <throat> it more, but that would really upset I thought Liverpool, yeah. Liverpool's, Liverpool's selling him, aren't they? They uh, are now. Well, well it can't, 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 can't play for the minute. Not now. In fact, I think he probably would have got a move to Real Madrid or Barcelona if this didn't happen. It's I think the fact that he has now gone and done this and we're not going shocking. to see him in a red shirt till November means it's going to be far more difficult for us to he'd win be, the league. He'd be cheap um, at the price, wouldn't he? I mean, you know, he went, why don't he just take his teeth out? We won't go down this year. I know where we're going with that one. Yes, go on. Look, this is probably what... Uh, I mean, I'm going to agree I'm, I'm going to agree with my UKIP colleague here and say I'm, I'm also a Liverpool fan. You know, I, I've been a lifelong supporter oh, of the dear, team. Oh, dear, yes. This is very you, depressing. And to all the Liverpool fans out there, you will never walk alone. But the thing is here, look, if we, we've just discussed something about the, the young men getting involved in violence and the dangers of that and how to stop it. This is not an example to set. No, Sportsmen no. need Shameful. to be setting a better example. They need to be coming forward to, to pull this country together and not to, to, to divide it in this way by, with such appalling behaviour. So I think it is justified uh, that he's disappeared. Yeah. Well, I, I'm sorry I can't resist this. This is a great topic to get our teeth into. And, oh, I, just, yeah. and I, just want to say, I just want to say, if <laughs> Liverpool get an offer, they should bite their hand off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's two news of the world headlines for you right here. <laughs> We've got to stop. A census taker once tried to test me. I ate his liver with some fava beans and a nice Chianti.